Hmm. Pain on Demo. This time is a playing a failure. Okay. Gotta be wary of like force bites here, which is gonna be pretty annoying to deal with. Got a pass is not that bad. I think I can just Morgan here though. If I get it, then that's fine. If I don't, oh, okay. Action. I'm ready. Nice, nice, nice. So basically, just need to look for equipment, and we should be gaming. Do not have T button one, bro. Do not have T button one. Do not, bro. Hey, you is it? What the flip is this? That's like legit no player that hasn't played T button one when they're playing T button X. It's it actually insane. Also, none of these cards are good here, right? Yeah, skip. Where the hell is Swing Glaive? Oh. Also, why does he have T-Wood in mind? How is it even possible? Oh, I got that new again, okay. Good people, don't look the other way. Even though I skipped there, I see how somehow draw it. He might try to sky splitter here. Okay, it doesn't. That's not that bad, but again, he said failure, so frostbites. Oh. Yeah, again, frostbites are, still, still could have mana for this pass here, I guess. Really? Oh, he's trying to level Timo here? Full speed? Oh. I guess I could try to go for it. I think the only thing that would protect Timo is Alex of Iron, though. Yeah, the only thing that would protect Timo here is Alex of Iron. I think it's worth. This action won't die here if it actually has Alex of Iron. He might be expecting me. Oh, he does have it. What the bleep? Why well, can't Prowl be zero man? I'm glad you love it, but yeah, that's fine. This is just gotta keep on attacking, gotta keep on applying the pressure. Still not blocking, okay. I guess, um, that's fine. I'll play this. Pretty decent. Next time I can go siphoning strike or maybe go for a grappling hole if I can get, can get into it, right? This is actually not that bad. I mean, no, this is horrible actually. Why would I ever pick this, right? Skip. Finders keepers. That's pretty decent. Another strike spell. Should I play for Zen Bakai? I don't think I need to. Um, Pingo, Bango. Yeah, I don't need to actually. I mean, I could just swarm the board. Nah, there's no need for it actually. Pass. Yes, I save up that one spell now because I could go for Siphoning Strike here, right? If I go for Siphoning Strike here, and then he Frostbite's Arshan, I could go for Proud to buff it up, so it's technically still work. 40 buff caps now, that's great. By all means, just let this happen, man. Do not deny this. Um, I can still Proud to kill him. Yeah, Proud still work. Let me get the flash freeze here. Whoa, it actually works. Holy crap, that's so good. I guess next turn, because it's gonna be turn 6, I'm most likely gonna develop this now. Because to play around. Okay, or to play around uh, Corina, right? Yeah. So he doesn't just activate a bunch of podcasts and I just die to it. Like it. Try to play it safe, right? Yeah. Just in case. Up, Bob. Yeah, he, he's definitely not planning to play uh, Arena, that's for sure. I guess I'll just buff up action then. Yes, one, two, three cards that okay. Gotta deal with Kaelin as well, actually. Kaelin's gonna be really annoying to do. Attack here. I'm gonna have Monster Lama. I guess I. What am I actually picking here? I guess I get try to give all my champions plus two, uh, plus two and spell shoot, huh? Oh, well, it's great. Yeah, I think I give it spell shoot actually. Giving action spell shoot here is actually pretty good since he's a threat now. Yes, oh well. Pass. And now I can actually try to kill something off. And I don't need to play around again for spite cards. Grabbing is quite nice. Oh, four puff gaps already, bro. There's no way. Holy crap. Okay, I'm against a Karina here. Okay, no Karina. Kimo? Caitlyn. Closing in on the mark. No backup needed. Well, I guess I gotta do this now. Yeah, yeah, I gotta do this. I know I take the 4 damage, but I think this will... Um, I could try to kill the Padlers, I guess, actually. Since he's always gonna attack with Caitlyn. Yeah. 
Why don't I just do this? And when he attacks Kaelin, and then I'll just buff Akshan. And I'll just kill one of the Paddlers here for now. Yeah, I think it's even better. It's either he attacks with Kaelin here or he doesn't. I think he always does though for the free for damage. That was actually insane that I joined the pop up caps there in one card. I mean, there's nothing I can stop this. So he, he just wants to attack for the full damage, which makes sense. Give me more attack. Um, change is actually not that bad. Plus two attack. No, plus two attack does more damage, right? Yeah, it's worth it. Give me more attack. No, I do not. And I guess tough. Yeah, playing on flash bombs just in case. Do this. Go peddler. Next turn, I'm most likely just going for a big open attack at this point. Try to represent later. And if he tries to go for the like spells that allows me to draw as well, I'll just deny it with this card. And I should be A-OK. Okay. Do this. Target. Um, plus one, plus one, don't be fearsome. Cool, ready. Bring us to Bakai. Siphon, there's no need. I mean, I guess it's kind of funny, but again, there's no need. You have one puff gap, you have four puff gap, and you have two puff gap. I guess I'll pick Samira just because of Samira has less, less puff gap. Sure. But at this point, it's most likely. Um, should I play another? There's no need to open it. I'll just attack it. This should be later. There's nothing he could do. Archon has spell shield. He needs two frostbite. Really? There's no way. There's no way. Oh my god, wait. There's no way. He had two frostbites there? Holy crap. Oh my god, could they have another one? Yeah, I'm just doing this. I could play Samila, I guess, but I get you know what sure. It's a 6-6. Six, six. Sure. Gives me flare as well, I think. There's no way I'm gonna be able to get ready though. I could by drawing, but again, drawing would just kill me anyway because of the top cap. Oof. Ah. Two mystic shots wins now. Kaelin. Oh, wait, does Kaelin win? Oh my god, Kaelin actually wins here. No, due to damage only, but. Spell shield again. Zolani. It's already do or die at this point. Is either a top deck two puff cap next turn or I don't. Scoping the area. Scum. Hey. Oh, he has a mystic shot. I do have this at night, so do not top deck. Do not top deck two puff caps. Can you sure? Please. Please game, please show mercy, show mercy, oh my god! So winnable, so winnable, so winnable, so winnable. So freaking winnable. GG. Good game, holy crap. That was so close, oh my god. Oh, GG, good game, good game. Lissandra Volibear? Ugh, hate the stack. He's gonna just go warm mask and I'm just gonna cry, basically. I'll keep one Akshan, more than the rest. Swing Glaive would be ama yeah, amazing. Like, Akshan and Swing Glaive is just the best combo in the game. Like, Lucky finds onto Akshan is insane. Golden Ambassador, if you draw me Samira, can I actually endless rally because of the Lucky find and the amount of casting we're playing each turn? Yeah, I'll gladly play him. If he dies here, then sure. I do have uh, Proud technically to play around, so Harvish. Or quite this here. I'll go for it. It's worth. Class. So, fuck, I was this. Top of Akshan. He's most likely gonna play the ramp card here. I'm gonna attack and get lucky like, finds as well. Yep. This is justice. He might block. He does. Okay. Would like to have the lucky find that gives, gives me oh well. Either that or spell shoot. Those two are the best keywords for Akshan right now. Can I just also no, actually there's no reason for challenge it, right? I think the spell shit is good in general. There's a play around vengeance and frost spice as well. Yeah. Hey, that's a mirror. I don't even need to like go in master. Okay, that's fine. I can actually go there's a duel here. Should I go for it? I think it's worth. I actually why would I do it next turn, right? I guess I should just do it next and I guess I'll just play Samira now. Yeah, so maybe I could try to rally. Not rally, but paper as well, that'd be great. Since I'm going to be generating a lot of lucky finds. Um, for some Bakai here could help me draw into like another buff spell. 
Yeah, pass. Um, grappling hole is quite good. I'll do this for now. He has cell mana only. If you try to level action here, get lucky fine so I can self target out to Samira so she doesn't die here. Yeah, let's go for it. You cannot run from absolution. Sadly, Samira did got nerfed to a flare, so it's not that easy to actually give Samira challenger and actually thing face the for the one damage. I wish they didn't nerf flare. They should have just nerfed this man. This is just that much of a problem that Samira got hit for no goddamn reason. I know Samira could be really annoying that, you know, just rallies and pings and challenger units. It's just a good card, but it should let her be good, right? Like, come on, Samira's not that broken. Also, I, I misplayed that. I probably should have targeted Samira there. I was keep, I keep on yapping that I forgot I needed to actually target Samira for the extra health. That's, oh, that's quite nice. Is there anything that I can actually strike though? Probably not. Because I actually need to remember that I need to actually strike something and kill it off, right? Most of his units by now is going to be pretty big, so there's no reason I could take that. Righteously reclaiming. Let's try this level Samira, shall we? Do this, area B. As long as I can play Poseidon Bakai into Flare, I should actually level Samira here. Give me Rhyne Negation. Is Rhyne Negation actually good? It could stop a big spell, which is not that bad. I guess Prowl though, right? Because Prowl could actually buff up action, so I can actually use Grappling Hook onto something else as well. Yeah, I guess Prowl. Do the ping, level Samira here, go for big attack. Don't hold anything back. I won't. Ah, the good old days when you can actually level Samira consistently. Mid. Because of face, no Samira flash actually cost two now, which is so bad. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Another flare, why not? I'll target Samira here, get extra health. Um I think I'll give the plus one plus one because we'll play around Shifu Wonders just in case. Yeah. Plus. Because she who won this would obliterate all followers with 4 less power, now Samira can't be obliterated because she's a 5-4. Pretty decent. She needs me to be... Okay, one more score. As long as it doesn't pull out something too big. Yeah, okay, that's pretty small, honestly. That's pretty weak. Can I get Rally here? Um, 1, 2... Lucky 5 would be the 3rd one. This would be the 5th one. I think I can't because that's, I don't have enough mana for it. So I guess I won't be going for it. But I could actually still... Technically, kill the Sandra here because I do advance my landmark anyway, which is not that bad. I guess I'm going for it. Yeah. Oop. Do this, do this, strike off the Sandra, get another one of the Warlord's Horde, and I'm most likely just gonna. Actually, could I? Three. Oh, wait, I could. I could. If I can draw into something Everyone that's one cost, like Sigil Black Eye. Could I? Yeah, I, I could be. I should be able to go for it. I'll just do this. I'll draw two cards. Give me something that's like one cost, please. Okay, yeah, GG. I think it's pretty much game. I didn't even need to use spell. I'll give Samira this yeah, spell shoe. <laughs> Don't even need to go for that, but just for flare, right? This ping on the Nexus. Yep, GG. I forgot I got I would got the zero cost focus speed spell that just uh, draw, allows me to draw two cards and just discounts my hand as well. So yeah, good game. Wow, Samira is actually good, right? Even though the flare was nerfed. I, I to be fair, I am playing against a slow deck, so there's that. Oh my god, of course it's this deck. Ah, Timo Yumi. Classic elusive shenanigans. At least he's not playing the face version. If he's playing the face version, that's more annoying, right? Because, you know, face is the nice everything. So this I could maybe come back, I guess. Like like grappling hook could strike or something good, which is real nice. Pass. Or you could actually join the quicksand as well, I'll just say. To Timo turn one. At least they don't have the attack cover, so that's not too bad. That's fine. He could attack with it. I'm not gonna block Akshan, obviously. Yeah. If I put Laleta onto Akshan, I could Grappling Hook next turn. But I think I'd rather just put Swing Glaive, right? Yeah. I mean, yeah, I think Swing Glaive is always the play. It's just too good. The fact that I have Prowl here is as well is pretty decent. Because I thought maybe he could Sky Split the dog here into a 3-6 and that would make a good trade against Akshan now, but since I have Prowl, it changes everything. I can gladly attack here. He might actually go for it. Yeah, he is going for it. Yeah, but th thank god I top the Prowl there. So, bada bing bam boom, GG. Now this is really good, because I just killed off the Doggo here, I get lucky fine. It's free, man. Thank god I top the Prowl there. If I didn't, I was most likely going for the Blood Light and the Grappling Hook, but since I top into it, duh, this is infinitely better. I guess extra health. 
OM is a good keyword, but I think I will take extra health just so I can have a decent blocker. Since Akshan, I need to block some of his units most likely if she turns. I mean, that's really good though. Yumi is really stupid though. Put grappling hook. Uh, not grab I could um blood letter into grappling. No way I can't. I can't really go for it. Oh Yumi is a tree tree bro? Oh because got buffed by snow dog. Duh. So even if I go blood letter, it's not good enough because I actually will go to tree attack. Um Well I guess the play is most likely this golden ambassador. No way, no way, it's just Samira here, right? There's no way it's golden ambassador, that's such a dumb idea. Yeah, I'll just go for Samira here. Mm -hmm. It is full damage, but it <laughs> could be worse, I guess. Do this, Bingo Pango. Actually, I probably should have went for it in La Naxon, huh? If I went for it in Naxon, it would help level Samira. Because I missed out on one other card in my hand now, so Samira will just reset when I have the attack token. I guess I should have went for it next turn. You cannot run from absolution. But I kind of didn't really want to give him priority. I really wanted the open attack here, in my opinion. That's actually quite decent. Hmm. I'll predict here, right? Yeah, I'll predict here. Quicksand is good. Yeah, quicksand. It's burst speed. He has no time to react, to protect, or whatever. This is good. I'll do this. Does he have like another Sky Spitter? Okay, he's not going for it. But he might like try to Sky Spitter Teemo or Frostbite Akshan to try to block with Teemo here, but if he doesn't go for it, it's fine. Ooh, that's actually really annoying. He steals my luck to find here, yeah. So I won't be able to grappling hook. I could still go for it, but it's slightly worse because I need to use Transfusion now. Oh, that's pretty bad. I, I guess I still go for it. No, I still go for it. I do not like Yumi. I know you could just put Yumi in the skip, but he needs to try to reset, right? Because he, Yumi, when he attack three times, he'll just get a spell shoe. Ah, uh, really? What the frick is this? Okay. At least I still get lucky fine, which is fine. I had a Nana Sky Spitter there. I need spear. Give me more health. Tough? Actually, he will go to 8 health. Take O well. I'm gonna quicksand Teemo only, right? Actually, I think I'll quicksand skip as well. So I can just kill two elusive units, so he can put Yumi onto the skip in future turns. I guess I should just pick more health, yeah. Pass. So I mean, I would have been A already if I uh, had blood. I played blood letter this time instead of last turn, by the way. But I should be able to level her. That's actually not that bad. I'm not forced to use quicksand here. He might try the tiny spear again, okay. Hmm. Yeah, it seems like a quicksand play. I like quicksand both on single unit though. That's probably the biggest question I need to ask here. I really want to just quicksand Teemo here. But I think just it's nah, I think I always just quicksand Teemo here, man. Yeah, it's just the play. It's just too good. So Akshan will die here. There's like nothing that can keep Akshan here. Yeah, okay, let's go. Give me another lucky find, so Samira's flip here. I should target Akshan here though still, right? Oh yeah, GG. Um why he why he leave though? I thought he still had a solid chance though, honestly. If he put Yumi on the skip there and constantly buff skip up to try to push Dita, he could have still won there. GG though. Good. Mm, he's dead grand. Um must be ephemeral and Yusuf. Ephemeral is kinda annoying, but it's not the worst thing in the world as long as he doesn't have shark, but if he has the uh, elusive crap, then I am gonna be in a rough position. I don't think I don't think I need Samira this early. The fact is that after the flare nerf, you can't actually keep Samira like on curve. Like even though I have the attack token on turn two, it's not really a good idea because the what what she's gonna do? She's not gonna be able to like I have if I pass on one, I won't be able to do the flare thing. So it's cost two now. So I guess I should put more. Screw you, face. Freaking nerf. Uh, Samira because of this. You should just rotate face at this point. Or maybe just increase the level cost. It's just too good. Let's be honest. Hopefully he doesn't have the 2 cost unit that summons a closely bad. That's probably the best 2 drop you could have here. Now yeah, play action. Next turn is either like there's a duel or like, maybe Zed I guess. That's also a pretty good target for there's a duel. Or maybe swing grave. Pass. Prow is not that bad actually. Oh, he does have the unit. I think I need to kill it now, honestly, right? It's either I go swing Glaive here, 
to buff up Akshan and then he's full board attacks and I take a lot of damage or I go Desert Duel to kill off one unit so I take less damage you know what, swing lift. I'm going for the high risk high reward type of deal, let's go for it I was kind of worried about a Z there to be honest but it, since it's not Z, I guess I'll block now yeah, do not have, okay I was a, a bit worried there that he might have Macro Dials the one mana give a unit plus 2 plus 2 and the family good thing he didn't have it I guess spell shield, right? I don't think giving extra health matters. I think spell shield is better because it dodges hate spike, but extra health is also quite good, so Akshan can be a future blocker, so... I guess extra health, sure. It's more likely that I need to use Akshan as a blocker instead of playing around hate spike, right? Yeah. And after I get- I, after I attack with Akshan, he'll give me another lucky find, so maybe I can hide with spell shield as well. Just saying. It's most likely gonna be a grappling hook into that 2-drop here. Yep. He does have a shark, so that's kind of worrisome. Um, Overwhelm is fine. I think I'd rather pick up again. No way, Overwhelm just helps me win the game though. Yeah, Overwhelm is good. Let's pick Overwhelm here. You cannot run from absolution. Maybe predict into like a uh, swing glaive or whatever. Unless I mean that would be great. That's another grappling hook. See if I think strike is decent, but it, he just denies it if he has deny, right? I guess it's that it's pretty decent, like it helps me advance my Lama. I think Golden, Golden Bastard is also quite good, right? It could draw into either Grappling Hook, which is basically another Archon, or Samira, which would basically give me endless rallies. The world won't save itself, you know. I think I go for the same player. Like, this is just is good. This is a good spell, why not? I'll just go for this. I have 3 mana, he needs to either develop here, or if he doesn't, then I'll go for Grappling Hook. And if he tries to go Archon, I'll go for this. Okay, he plays enough Shark. So this is definitely the play here. Get another Lucky Find, shall we? Try to win the game. Big Akshan here. Plus one, plus one. I get. Nah, actually, no. Plus two attack. Let's go all in on the Akshan here. Plus. I'm pretty sure Akshan is never gonna die here. I have Renegation at this. I have Sesame Strike. I have Does it do? Like, Grappling Hook. I have so much Strike Spell in hand. I do not need to be worried about anything. Go pass. Play like a Gwen or Z. Whatever you want to do. Just do it. I dare you. Okay, that's pretty annoying, actually. It's a bit annoying. A bit. I'm going to 3 health. I'll just do this. Just buff up action as well. Mm, Lamb will go to 2. Um, I guess it's actually not that bad of a play. I think the only thing that could stop this is basically hate spike, right? Basically. I need to stop. The only reason I want to stop this is because of the fact that he could have. Uh, it will summon both of the sharks again, right? That's why I want to keep this unit. Yeah. I do not want to deal with the shark. It's basically 3 6 damage it, each turn he attacks with a femoral unit. It's really annoying. They're pretty dang good. Come in, come in. He's attacking here? Bro, really? Okay, now that's uh. Oh, well, that's stupid. That is a pretty smart play though. I'll give him that. But I, I'm forced to block like this then. If he has another one, I lose here actually. Okay, he doesn't have it. I need to go all in on the action then, just to try to OTK him, but I don't even think it's possible, just saying. Next turn I need to win. Um, plus one, plus one. I think I'm just giving action spell shoot here. Let me just see what lucky finds I can give on the action first of all. Oh, well. Oh wait, fearsome. Holy shit. Oh, oh, oh holy crap, oh my god. Okay, spell shoot, okay, yeah, win next turn, right? Attack with Akshan, put Prow on the Akshan, 14 damage, fearsome, cannot can't block at all. He needs Makari Yals, that, that's the only thing that could force Akshan. I mean, to block Akshan, but. This is yeah, this is a leader. Uh, should I quicksand to reduce attack? Um, even if I reduce them to one attack, both of the units, he goes to Makari Yals with a trade. Yeah, it's, 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 it's GG. Either he has Makari Yals, do GG, good game. Holy crap, that was insane. <laughs> <laughs> that fearsome key would actually won. Ooh, GG. Hmm. Yeah. Tiger Oof, log deck. It's gonna be quite hard. I do have a lot of good blockers, more or less. I, I am good at attacking, but not blocking. So, yeah, it might be rough. Okay, you swing left though. Oh, wow, okay. That is horrible. <laughs> Passing turn 1, turn 2 in the distant country. That's not a good plan. At least something turn 2, please. Holy crap, yeah, I guess this is <laughs> most likely GG. 
unless he missed Lurk a few times and maybe doesn't hit Rek'Sai or Pyke, then we'll come back here. Ahead, we know how to prepare. I guess I play this turn 3 into this on turn 4, most likely. I could put Swinging Glaive onto this, but eh, it seems like... Oh, he did miss Lurk. Wait, what? He predicted that. How did he miss Lurk? He just passes there? Okay. No, oh, that was a pretty weak play by his part. Back. Okay. He really just passed there. That's so weird. Not passed, but when he predict, you you have the option to skip, by the way. So I guess he really did, did skip there, huh? Okay. I guess I'm just doing this. I mean, I was just joking, but I didn't know he really skipped there and somehow missed Lurk. Did he- maybe he predicted all of his cards and there were none that are actually good Lurker units, so he skipped there and then he missed Lurk here. That is incredibly sad. Give me more health. Yeah, more health. So it's a 5-4 now, so we can actually survive if he decides to pull this unit away. That's really good for me then. I mean, <laughs> it's already turn 4 and he have, hasn't hit Lurk once, so that's good news. That's fine. Mm. Yeah, I mean, GG. Like, he missed Lurk, so it was bound to the game. And he didn't even have Snap Joe's on for the next turn, so... Yeah, even though my hand was horrible there, but him not think Lurk once just loses him the game. Oh, Morgana. Oh, Morgana. Brow, you're okay. Uh, okay, sure. That's fine. Morgan, Morgan, Morgan. Try to fight Arch on turn 2. No Arch on turn 2, but I need to have this on turn 3. Another one? Okay. <laughs> two copies of the three drops and two top copies of Swing Glare. Sure. Hey, that's Arshan. Do I play Arshan here though? I think I always. Yeah, I always play. Since I have the attack token as well, I can easily just go Swing Glare here just to get some lucky finds and help me advance the ammo. It's turbo, it's turbo Wolf. Ooh, ah. Well, that's kind of sad. He's obviously gonna destroy the Swing Glaive here. Thank god I have another one, but that's still pretty bad. Yeah. Rip me, I guess. Give me extra health. Yeah, extra health. Should I actually know? I should probably go for it next, and if I really want to, so I can pop grab and hope, right? Yeah. If I want to kill something, I go Blood Letter into the Grab and Hope. If I don't, then I'll just play Swing Glaive here. Bone Club? Holy crap. Well, I guess I'm still going Blood Letter here, right? Just so I can target, and so Action Dice gives me a 1 on focus here. Yeah. That's a pretty big unit. Should probably play this, right? I should probably play Action. It's, more, it's better. Yeah, Action is better. You want to slam Mark next time you go to 0, and I can just level Action here. You cannot run from Absolution! Seems like a pretty good play if I do say so myself. Samira, what's up? Um, I, if I play Samira, I won't be able to go for these two combo. I will, however, go be, will be able to go Blood on the Grab and Hook as well, still, which is not that bad. But I would like to try to advance the damage as quick as possible. That's not that bad, sure. It's not a strike spell, why not? Could come in handy. I'll try to go for uh, advance the damage with Lucky Finds. I mean, it's still a bit annoying, but I still like you off the. Energy unit steel, which is the main point of this combo anyway. It is sad though I don't get a type option, but could be worse. Not to find this half uh spell shoe is good. Um I could do this. Yeah, sure. Next turn is most likely gonna be Desert Duel on Turbo Morgana. If, if he equips then I'm I guess I'll just develop the tree drop so I can just play a blocker. Was that Bakai? Okay. Robbing? Sure. Really, that's the play. I could do this, but then action goes to what? 3 health. If I do advance the damage, I can just give everything spell shoe as well. Or draw. Or maybe... The lucky find would give action action. I think yeah, this will. It's turbo worth it. Because this also technically advances the landmark. So, it's so worth it. Bonk. Hmm, don't really care. No mind about that. 
If I give Elma champions plus two plus one spell, I can just play Samira and then actually Samira is a 4 4. She dies to this unit though, it's pretty annoying. Um, what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Oh, I could just draw two as well, actually. Oh wow, he's a here? Okay. I guess he didn't really think that he could come back. Maybe he was worried that I have another strike spell actually, because if I had like another grab before, I can actually still skew the scout unit with the auction there. GG.